Welcome or welcome back to my channel, you guys. And this is your girl, the Glam Empress. And I'm so happy to be showing you guys this wig that I got from Arabella Hair. And it is a 24 inch loose wave transparent lace three by four frontal wig. And you guys, this wig was way better than what I expected. It was so full, it was long, it was true to length. And you guys, like, it had so much hair. Like, the hair was so full. Like, I want to say it was about either a 180 or a 200% density. I will have all the information and details listed below. But the lace was definitely giving. It wasn't too thick. It wasn't too thin. Um, you do have to bleach the knots. As you guys can see, you can see the little black knots. But as far as it blending in with my skin um, it definitely blends as you guys can see it is transparent um, and I'll just go ahead and have my hairstylist bleach the lace Shout out to Arabella Hair for sending the cute goodie bag that had the edgy wrap, some lashes and a baby hair brush and all types of stuff y'all the beauty supply store that I usually go to, they didn't have the regular packs of bleach that I usually like to get. So I had to start off with this. And you guys, bleaching this hair, what was I thinking to have that little bitty uh, products, y'all? It took so much to bleach this hair, y'all. And I'm not really, like, I'm not a professional by any means at all, y'all. Don't get me twisted. But I don't color hair that often. Usually I buy it colored. Sometimes I color it, but majority of the times I buy it colored or my hairstylist will color the hair because I don't be having time. But I wanted to try something new. And you guys, when I first started coloring this hair, I was like, oh my God, like this is not a lot of product at all. But this is just me getting the bleach and everything together. First, I wanted to start off with 40 developer. So I'm just mixing that up right now. So first I'm going to start adding my bleach to the ends of the hair and you guys this was way more work than I expected to be but I got to trust the process because we're already here and as you guys can see the hair already started to process and I was just like oh my god this is a lot of hair it's processing quickly like what am I going to do but I just kept going y'all and of course I did run out of bleach and I had my mother go and pick up some more bleach powder and you you guys will see that later on in the video but right now we are working our way up and like I said this hair was definitely true to length it had to be a little bit more longer than 24 inches y'all and also the density was super thick like I mean I'm not complaining by any means but I definitely didn't know what I was getting myself into So as you guys can see, the hair is processing beautifully. So I'm just working my way along the wig. And y'all, sometimes I'm using the brush and then sometimes I get lazy and just slapping the bleach on. And I know y'all like, well, girl, you could have just did a, be a bleach bath and all that type of stuff. Well, y'all, this ain't my house to be doing all that type of crazy stuff with chemicals. And plus I have a dog, so I don't want his nose getting all messed up. Granted, I'm in the middle of the kitchen, but that's besides the point. But anyway y'all I'm just working my way through the hair as quickly as I can I am doing this as well like on my breaks and stuff so I have to move quickly but yeah you guys Don't forget to hit that subscribe button give me a thumbs up and turn on your notification bell so that way you don't miss out on another episode so now I am going in with my silicone mix you guys and I am putting that on the hair so that way I can have it flowy and get in the cuticles of the hair back intact because you know bleaching is very harsh on the hair 
And you guys, I do apologize that this video is jumping all over the place. I am trying to do this wig in between working two jobs and getting ready for my Atlanta trip. But now that the hair is dry, I am able to see the spots that I missed. And I was very impressed on how this hair took to me processing it to the bleach color, you guys. And with the right products, the hair is able to bounce back. I did use my Shimmer Lights shampoo and conditioner and as well as Olaplex and then and also you guys saw the silicone mix and the hair went back to its original softness I would say when I was bleaching this hair it did lose a lot of that loose curl pattern that I essentially bought the wig for but all in all I was so excited and so happy about my wig I do believe that it is longer than 24 inches and also the density was amazing especially for the price that I paid I will leave all of Arabella's details down below in the description bar and thank you so much for watching you guys you will see the install in the next video don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel and you guys will see me in the next video